it means he has inter internet connection oh got it okay because i see him play i see him play multiple games but then again he is playing single player games so that would make sense Ooh, crypto dundee and we unlocked way of the furon oh and haiku slinger i might, I might have to go with this one here you going with krampus Damn. What, he wants to face you? I mean, yo, if he wants to smoke with you, that's on him. That's on him, bro. I, I'm trying to I'm trying to ease him into it. If he, if he thinks he's that good, that's him, bro. Okay, so we're in Russia now. The snowy area. Feel like home. Feel like home. There's our bay right there, all dressed up. Back in the USSR. So this is Tunguska. Yikes. It's good to be back in with the, the yikes. USSR, but this place makes the rest of Siberia look tropical. Yeah, little nippy. I better incinerate something for heat before my tool falls off. Can't have that. Oh, you pick it up quick, Moody. We can arrange right for creative combustion. We need to gather intelligence. You should you should have seen how her original model looks like in the original game. It look it does not look nearly as good as in the remake. You know it, sugar. What do you need me to do? I'm not sure yet. I'll know more after Agent Sergei briefs me. <laughs> Sergei? Oh, no, uh, is this Cold War? Yes. No, I think game. I think yeah, I see, this might be around the Cold War. No, no, Cold War's Intel 90s. This is way before the 90s. Yeah, This takes place in the 70s, I think. Off. What's he got that I ain't got? Hair for one thing. Here he comes. I should Let know. Me do the talking. Takes place in like the the 40s, I think. It's my big ass hat on, on the outfit I'm wearing. Ukraine girls knock me out. Moscow girls make me shout. It's good to see you, Sergei. Well, that's saying didn't age well. <laughs> that's, you look devastating. That's saying didn't age well. I know, but we have no time for further verbal foreplay. What can you tell me of Project Solaris? Not as much as I'd like. Not as much as I'd like. There is a classified area nearby, obscured day and night by a cloud of radioactive gas. I believe it is the source of the insidious organic weapons being used to subjugate. Svolochi. Ah, the area plans are kept in a high security section of KGB headquarters. Can you sneak us in? You he does look. He does look. Like, like, he does look like the stone face emoji. Now. now, if it were just the two of us. Jealousy, Sergei. Though the fire fades, comrade, the embers may yet smolder, even in the tundra. <laughs> Thank He's you, like, comrade. Ugh. We'll find our own way in. Now go. Don't be we flirting with. Be don't be flirting with our with our human chick. That star. That star killer. Star killer's an eye girl, bro. <laughs> That's mine and star killer's girl, bro. That's our human, right, star killer? <laughs> yeah, I love how he doesn't see the giant so cowboy hat. Exactly what kind of history do you have with this Sergei guy? Exactly the kind you think, Crypto. Not that it's any of your business. Damn. Hey, see whoever you Attitude. want. You, you can bang the Red Army chorus for all I care. Your permission is noted. Now can we get to work? Okay, so how do we get our hands on the plan? Sergei says we'll have to sneak into the KGB headquarters and steal them. Oh, Sergei says that, does he? He does. The odds will be against us. The place is swarming with agents. Easy. Well, Crypto says bring them on. The more the freaking Dunk merrier. was good, bro. Okay, then. Hmm. Actually, you might be onto something there, Crypto. 
If you can create a large enough disturbance, it might lure most of the agents out of the building. And while I'm playing monkey ball, you'll sneak in and grab the plans. Gotcha. Okay, doll face, I'm off to stir up the Soviets. Be careful in there. You hear me? Don't worry, Crypto. You keep them. Yeah, I have it on my shelf as well on PS2. Fine. Whatever you do, I played the original remake. From the HQ so Good I haven't beaten the second remake yet. So I was like, "Fuck it, let me beat it." Just in case they make a third one, you know, just in case they remake the third one. So kill people, kill people with the mist, bro. A any person counts, by the way. It, it doesn't have to be soldiers. There you go. Alright. Now destroy the property. Yeah, this game, you know, the remake does a lot of quality of life changes that the original didn't have, which I love. Obviously, modernize the controls. Yeah, Starkiller, once I upgrade our telekinesis, we'll, we'll be able to pick up cars and shit. Safe house. Sergey Sergey's grandma's house. Crossed off. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, granddad's. Use extract brain on Tally's attackers. Take intruders down. Star killer controller die.
Let's go, Natalia. Let's go quicker, quicker, quicker. Quicker. Uh oh. Star Killers. Star Killers Wi Fi. You good, Star Killer? Star Killer just loses his whole connection or what? Last Wi-Fi. Okay, are you? Let me. Are you good? Like, uh, let me know when when I, you want me to uh, bring you back in. I swear, bro told us. I I fixed my I fixed my uh, my internet connection. <laughs> AJ really wants to make sure Davey keeps that title. <laughs> I love it. I say your first one seem up and your second is uh, Nikki and third could be Nyx. How about that? Try that out. I mean, technically you could do that. <laughs> technically you could. If you, if they, if you manage to agree, if they manage to agree, you could get your three out of the way right there like that. Hey, right, let me, let me know. Let me know when, uh, when I'll bring you back in. I'm sorry your Wi-Fi's acting up, bro. If there's one thing I can do, it's make with the boom boom. Ask about the plants that Talia stole. So how about those plants, you swine? They the real deal or what? I just had time to glance at them quickly before the alarms went off. There seem to be a number of tunnels and a lot of security around them. And it looks like the tunnels have these bizarre organic pumps inside which are what's pumping the radioactive gas over the area. Ask what you should do. So I take it we're gonna put these organic pumps out of Right, that is! God damn! But a direct assault would be dangerous. He should keep his opinion I among his colleagues and cater. Lay low for a while, Tovarish. I'll be back soon. Why do they incoming, always incoming ask me the one thing I suck at? Okay, the mission's done, Starkiller. Let me know if you need uh, invite invite back. Because it's a co-op story mode, I need someone to play with. So, hopefully, your Wi-Fi is good enough to come back. Your Wi-Fi is cooked. Oh man. Yep, no problem. <clears throat> I got you, bro. Hello? I can't even call on the saucer. Oh, nice. I do new artwork. It's the it's the Christmas jingle in there. Yeah, the saucer. I can't I can't call it. Like, no matter how many how many times I click on it, it's, it's bugged. Oh, that's a mission. Let's let's try let's climb that smokestack right there. If I, if my jetpack could even make it up there.
so close and I'm good. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Oh, here we go. But this is probably the tallest part. Oh, oh, these guys are chilling here. Dead. This is probably, I think this is the tallest part in Tegusco, right? I also have a saucer. What do you mean by that? The Siberian job. Dobry den, tovarish. Dobry den. Ask Natalia about the tunnels. Hey, gorgeous. Did you find out any more about those tunnels? <laughs> what I found is a scientist who works in the organic weapon technology program here. He knows all about the machines in those tunnels. I, uh, persuaded him to talk. I know about the machines. What'd you find out? Is there any easy way to shut those things down? Those pumping machines are actually organic little nuclear reactors. Incredible! Not to mention highly unstable. A nuclear fuel rod placed inside one will overload it and cause a meltdown. And there just happens to be a nuclear plant in Oh, town. I was just on there. Ought to be a few fuel rods lying around. Exactly. If you get some fuel rods, Sergey and I will smuggle them into the tunnels. Okay, Goldie, I'll get your fuel rods for you. But I expect a <laughs> I expect big a big reward. reward. Agent Sergey is acquiring Double the reward actually. As we speak. He'll meet you when you find them. Hmm. You can ask him for your reward. Oh, I don't want him to give me a word. Yeah, true. <laughs> I feel that. I feel like exactly crypto. I feel it. Star Killer, come back. Star Killer, come back. are doing many nuclear experiments in town but i am not caring i am having enough to be depressed about i mean look at this place it's arg voodle right here thou shalt render no images of false gods especially ones which are more attractive than mine eliminate those idols destroy this destroy the statue in the nearby But destroy the statue on the nearby square. What statue? What statue is this guy talking about? Oh, there it is. Oh, you got caught. Okay, perfect. Gotcha, gotcha. Sorry. Just gonna destroy this thing right here real quick. Okay. Oh, I just you just made it back. <laughs> and you're back. Cool. There you go. All right, hey, hey, don't let it don't let it drive you crazy, bro. Trust me. It, it, it already drove me crazy. I just accept it now. We're all a little mad. Oh, <laughs> uh, that lady's just walking in the air. Like Russian woman. Thrashing body of 
running out of fuel rods. They must send them on slowest icebreaker ship in all of Siberia. I knew it should not be. The Arkvoodle right here, Arkvoodle. Express. We absolutely positively have to be there sometime within the next six months. What kind of stupid... Oh, AG, you missed it, bro. We, we, we watched the... Um, we watched the, the 2K trolling video edited earlier today in the VOD. It, it, it's releasing tomorrow anyway, so you can wait tomorrow at 10 a.m., but we watched it. Bro, so funny. I, I, I showed the chat. It's in the VOD anyways, if you want to... If you don't want to wait till tomorrow at 10 a.m., but... Oh man, we were dying at that, bro. Yeah, just wait till you see, wait till you see what Arda did with that shit, dude. <laughs> You're not even in it, buddy. <laughs> Short, this short last vehicle. Harder. I mean, harder, sorry. This short last vehicle, sorry, killer. There's the last truck right there. Destroy, destroy that bitch. Destroy that truck. There you go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, whenever, um, <laughs> I, I'm not going to spoil it, actually, AJ, I'm not I, I won't spoil it, I'll let you watch it tomorrow. Funny stuff. I can actually see the objectives now. Oh my god, because for you it was so blurry, right? <laughs> You're probably like, I don't know what I'm doing, bro. I'm just going towards the yellow marker. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Okay, how do we upgrade... We can upgrade the shield. It's already maxed out. We definitely got to upgrade the ship because we're going to need it for that for the final boss, if I recall correctly. We're going to need it for the final boss. So let's upgrade the ship. The saucer shield. Sonic boom. Yeah, about to wait. It looks like some of our enemies have foolishly blocked the road out. I had to deal with them myself, but my hands are a bit full. Take them off to me while I put the last container onto the truck. Would you come in? It seems the authorities have been alerted to a presence somewhere. Ordinarily, I would have used them all with one hand tied behind my back for sport, but since I'm driving, why don't you follow me to the safe house to ensure our cargo around? Destroy the tank? Destroy the, a tank with a tank. Here, pick this tank up. So we gotta find another tank. Okay, uh, put, put it down for now, put it down, put it down. Yeah. 
we, 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 we gotta clear they had to clear this yeah okay good he's turning okay So when we find another tank, we'll uh, we'll destroy him with it. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Right there. There we go. Oh, the robots, that's what's hitting me. Shit, uh, press, press down the D-pad. Press down the D-pad back, I pressed it back same. There you go, yep. Oh, press down, press down on the D-pad. There you go. Well done, Crypto. Our cargo has arrived at the safe house. Now come and see. We need to... Fuck your safe house. So down the D-pad swaps uh, controls for us in the saucer. Whoa. Look at that, finished already. And here I was, just getting started. Of course, I work out. Don't know if you knew that. Thank you, Crypto. Sergey and I can take it from here. I'll bet. Uh, hey, how about I just stick around and help you out myself? You know, since I'm already here, I'm sure Sergey's a busy guy, you know. Embassies to bug, dissidents to torture. You're very generous, Crypto. But I think he can find the time. I'll rejoin you once he and I have disabled the machines in the caves. Until then, try and stay out of trouble. Then no kiss? No kiss goodbye or what? Okay, well, whatever. Air kiss. We'll take it, right, Star Killer? We'll take what we can get. Yo, the safe house is on fire, bro. Well. <laughs> That wasn't condescending. So, he makes time with my girl while I sit around and twiddle my phalange pods. Is that it? Well, homie, don't play that. I made it through a whole nother game all by myself. I don't need anybody's <laughs> permission to knock some monkey heads. Fourth wall Certainly breaking. Not some chicks. He breaks the fourth wall like Deadpool does. That's what I love crypto. He said, I made it through another, I made it through a whole another game by myself. I don't need a girl.
Damn, how far are you? How far is this location? A deadly reaction. Привет, товарищ. How's it hanging? Little to the left. <laughs> hey, not bad, yo. Little to the left. So you shut down the pumps in the tunnels with those fuel rods? Yet. Too much KGB heat on the tunnels because of the theft. I should have seen it coming. Anyway, it's too dangerous for Sergei and me to infiltrate them now. Well, we gotta shut those pumps down. Whole town smells like Newark. Smells like New oh, Hampshire. Real, Crypto. Have no fear. And this time, I want you on the job. I need you to carry a fuel rod into each of the tunnels and place it in the reactor of each of the pumping machines. Sergey and I have hidden a container of fuel rods near each tunnel. Wait, <laughs> uh, you lost me. Didn't you say the tunnel entrances were crawling with KGB? No, nah, but not while the scientists conduct their weekly radiation tests. No sweat, dollface. Consider those bumps out of order. Yeah, Star Killer. Every like every upgrade now, I have to put it towards the saucer because the final boss, if I recall correctly, in the PS2 game, the final boss was annoying. Oh, you're, you're going the right way. He's over here somewhere. I don't expect you to carry that fuel rod into the tunnel with your bare phalanger parts, Crypto. Use your psychokinesis. Did I just break it? Oh, it was right there. Yeah, right in there. Machine reaction in the reactor. The reactor's on the reacting. So reminds me of uh, Stranger Things. You know, this is way before Stranger Things, but get out, get out. Second bunker. I wouldn't have thought humans have the technology to make an organic machine like this. It seems far beyond their primitive capabilities. There's something vaguely alien about this. I can't quite put my phalanger part on it. Oh. Carry on! Oh, kill humans with, with, with radioactivity? Yeah, 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 I was gonna say, yeah, hold it, hold it in the, hold it, hold it in the radioactivity. Kill that robot, I gotta look for more humans. Oh, actually, no, there's probably, they're probably inside. There we go, right here. Oh, 
How's that guy not dying? Funny, that's that, that's the same actor. Hawks is the same voice actor as Chaos from Skylanders. I'm so I'm so glad you brought that up. I'm so glad you recognized it. This, this Moody, this is why you're a legend, bro. See Moody, this is why you're a legend. It's him. Yeah. <laughs> Is that what? Bye. <laughs> Kill humans with kill human oh, oh kill the kill the human attackers. Oh we gotta kill them, we gotta kill them. Go 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 Oh my god, with one second. <laughs> with one second. <laughs> yeah, same voice actor. I don't know. Who, I, I I can't remember who Crypto plays. I know Crypt, Crypto sounds so familiar too. So now Star Killer, we're gonna start we're gonna start fighting like like these alien monsters soon. These things I think they're called Blisk. They're they're pretty strong. We're about to head to it right now. It might be a boss. I don't know. But there's Arc Voodle here anyways. But yeah, but these, we're, we're going to find these alien monsters called Blisk. I can't remember what the easiest way to kill them are. Might, might just be the Iron Detonator. I know, I love Skylanders. I love, that TV, I love the TV show on Netflix too. What do these freaks want? Oh, the games are blasts. Yeah, there's some of them. There's some of my favorite platformers. I wish they made more after Imaginators. Imaginators were so good. Wait a minute. Now that I think of it, that machinery looks suspiciously familiar. Fear on tech. Holy hookers of our Boodle! Crypto, do you know who these freaks are? They're not commie cabbage heads. Great galaxies, no. They're not even human. Yeah, I skipped the racing one the too. Enemy. Our enemy. See? The Bliss. Enemy the Furons defeated in the Martian war. Crypto. The Blisk. Blisk? Wait a minute. I, I thought we wiped the Blisk out. Now the Blisk are on Earth. I have no explanation. I can barely believe my senses. But a few of them must have somehow survived. Not for long. Attention, Blisk. I am Cryptosporidium of the planet Furon. This planet is now a territory of the Furon Empire. And your asses belong to me. Hey, yo, Crypto's freaky like that. Remind me of, I mean, it reminds me of the TV show Invincible. When he said that. 
Hey, you want you want is what? Uh, warm up the idle disintegrator. No problem. Boom, boom, boom. Easy done. All right, kill the blisk. So, so, so they have an armor. You see the bottom part? That's the armor shield. Then they have an actual health bar. These motherfuckers are annoying. You want to use like the iron detonator and shit like that, bro. Like the big, the high explosives. And for the little guys, they're a lot easier to kill. You just got to use the uh, the anal probe, I think it was, first. And then once they transform, just kill them. The what? <laughs> the anal probe. You heard me? I didn't stutter. Yeah, the show's good. Unfortunately, it, it stops at season two, I think. I don't think they're making another another season. And the season ends at a cliffhanger too, which it. fucking sucks. You gotta fill me in on this whole Lisk <laughs> thing, Pox. My my hard drive is spinning. I hardly know where to begin. They're huge, hideous brutes with giant claws and withering halitosis. They have a single hive mind and an imperviousness to radiation. They take to it like a pig to mud. Imagine a cockroach mating with a lobster. Yikes. Oi, enough already. You're making me, making me queasy. queasy. He's obsessed. The Tunguska blast of 1908 was caused by a meteorite. But now we know its true cause. The fiery crash of a Blisk warship. Ooh. Yeah, well, don't you worry. Chernobyl was done because of a Blisk warship. This time they're going down for good. A bold statement. Many furons fell thanks to the Blisk. And there's another problem. Since the war, the furon defense budget has yeah, been for sure. downsized. I fear that most of our current weapons will be ineffective against the Blisk. I still gotta beat, um, I still gotta play SWAT Force, I think I have to beat. And SWAT Force, Giants. I played the first Skylanders, but SWAT Force and Giants I still gotta beat. There's actually quite a lot I still gotta beat. Okay, well, at least we know what we're up against. What do you want me to do? I'll contact you with new Yeah, that's a fun, yeah, I heard it's a fun one, yeah. Idea what's going on. Until then, just don't do anything rash. The only thing is, though, nah, I don't have that many figures, that. so I'm going to have to go as only, like, one figure throughout the whole game. As long as... The, hopefully, the game allows that. Like, hopefully... Hopefully, the game allows me to play as one figure. Because I have my Spyro figures on the shelf, but... That's, so, that's the only one I could really use. It's my Spyro figures. Zapomatic, the Bliss Shields. Oh, we didn't do that. Star Killer. Trap team, that's that's another one. Yeah, that's the other one. Yeah, the only one the only one I didn't like was the racing one. I mean, I get it. You know, Stark um uh, Skylanders tried to do everything. I mean, like, you know what I mean? Like they had like so many ideas you can only think of, right? So it was it made sense they did racing too. The kart racing. And then Imaginators being the last one, which is which is a really good game. Imaginators was a blast, especially with the Crash Bandicoot introduction. I really hope they revive it. Unfortunately, it's it's trapped under Activision. I, that's, that's what I'm saying too. It's time to bring that shit back. Just because like Spiral and Crash is so big now. I am not 
I don't know if that I don't think that's a KGB agent, so killer. I think that's a regular soldier. KGB are in the suits, I believe. Stupid American alien. Oh, oh, that, oh, oh, he just wanted one. Okay, no more. He just wanted one KGB agent. Yeah, I feel like they have the tech now where they can like make it so that you don't really need a portal with all the cables and shit. You can probably have like a wireless portal or something. The comrade who came something. Hey yo, the comrade who came, pause. Ask Sergey what he wants. Get to the point, Sergey. I'm a busy Furon. I have a lead on Project Solaris. You might want to follow up on it. Okay, what's the lead? Project Solaris, huh? Okay, I'm listening. I have the name of the researcher in charge of the organic weapons program. His name is Dr. Orlo. And... Bro, I have Dr. Eon's Elite Spyro. That's it. That shit's so powerful. Search up Eon's Elite Spyro. The damage and, like, health on that is crazy. I also have Dark Spyro... Um... Like the Dark Spiral version that has like silver on it, Legendary Spiral. Okay, so you got a name. Where am I supposed to find this Orlov guy? I have been unable to discover his current whereabouts, but this is a small town. Everyone knows everyone else's business. And I got one of those faces everybody opens up to. Although I doubt Orlov will be in a talky mood. Do what you have to do. Gee, that really means a lot coming from the KGB. Yeah, for real. Yeah, exactly what Starkiller said. Like, it'd be really like it, Activision can make a killing if they bundled all the Skylander games in one bundle, put it on Steam, even on consoles where it's virtual and uh, and you don't need the figures. It's just virtually built in, just like how I can play the Infinity games now without needing any of the figures. Nothing. Okie dokie. Good luck, comrade. And don't be afraid to get a little rough. Hmm? Well, you can't make an omelet without breaking a few Fabergé eggs. Sergey likes her off. Pause. Curiosity is What is with all these scientists living out my frozen leg? Conducting strange and mysterious experiments, no doubt. He's not helping property values on my shack. Not living out my frozen leg. Crazy doctor out there, always running bizarre experiments. When any sensible person is knowing, science is nothing but smoke and mirrors to make him peasants feel stupid. Now, exchanging with the northwest. I must be checking horoscope before I'm going to psychic ball. Freeze to death and throw up like vendors. Or walk. Walk would be very nice. <laughs> when the conversation overlaps, it's too funny. Who's that? Oh my god, it's Doc from Back to the Future! Got that Dr. Robotnik here. Ah, help! Help me! Dead monkeys tell no tales, and I need to pick this one's brain about Project Solaris. Crap. Better save his monkey. To make sure we keep track of the uh, objectives. Use gastro. Here we go. Me too. I, I have I have quite a lot. They're in my they're in storage. Gastro, hit him.
There you go. That's all we needed right there. That's all we needed. Meteor strike time. Yeah, they're about closet. I got so many games, bro. So many figures, man. Oh my god. So what happened was, I went to a, uh, I went th to my my local thrift store. Had so many. Sometimes I'd find like like bags full for like four bucks, just of scouting figures because the thrift store didn't really know how like how much they were worth or whatever. <laughs> Thank you, Don. What what am I celebrating? <laughs> what am I celebrating? That's a steal, exactly. Yeah, literally. I'd be, it'd be like I'd see, I'd, I'd catch the, I'd catch the figure bags. I'd be like, damn, it's like there's like ten of them in here for, you know, four or five bucks, and some of those figures are like the rare ones. Sixtieth birthday. Oh, okay. You won against the big boss. Oh, you talk about the the uh, yellow long boss in Wukong? Yeah, thank you, brother. Yeah, I'm still I'm still stuck on I'm still stuck on the current boss, which is the dust the dust devil or something like that. So he's giving me trouble, but I'm gonna beat him today, 100. percent I better. I want to beat. I want to beat chapter five today. Sorry, I want to beat chapter four today. Get, hopefully, get like halfway through chapter f chapter five. Ideal situation would be I literally beat chapter five as well. I doubt it though, because I'm sure there's gonna be a boss that's gonna get me stuck for hours. But I I have I have my spiral cards only because those are the main. The spiral one was the mainly one I cared about. But yes. I wish, in hindsight, I wish I kept all my cards for the brand new figures. Unfortunately, all the figures that came in those bags I was talking about didn't come with any cards. Because I have a Spiral and Crash card collection. I have some rare cards from like the early 2000s, 994. It's probably like the, the, the early 90s, is probably my rarest card for Crash. Yo, they gotta make another Skylander game and make it, co make it online co op, bro. Or even if they do local co-op, I mean, we can I can just share play co-op like I'm doing with Starkiller, but dude, that'd be fun as fuck. Four player, four player Skylander co-op, hell yeah. Share play four players. I gotta get some more transmog. Don't forget, to, don't forget to transmog stuff if you need ammo. Oh, smoked them. Here we go. Hey, what's well, Kino Trigger? Oh, that was such a good celebratory Corona. After I beat Yellow Long. But with the thing is, Kinder Sugar, once I beat the current boss I'm on, I can then craft that really good staff. Because the Dust Double is the only is the boss I need to kill to get the to get the staff. He's ha he has the missing item. Doctor Orlov, I presume. How come you don't get cool punctuation like Dr. Go? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Looks like you had a little KGB infestation. Lucky I was here to exterminate him for you. I did not oh, know because I never played it. Was you? Actually, I mean, that's a lie. I covered Imaginators a little bit. Coordination. I made like you one video on Imaginators. You computer game I've been developing in spare time. Games? On a computer? <laughs> You're wasting your time, Doc. 
Because like I said, Crash and Spyro are like my two favorite like mascot characters. So when Imaginators got announced and Crash was in it, that's when I covered it, talk to, talking about Imaginators. So Doc, you got a sec? I need to ask you a few questions. Oh, he's all? I was afraid you were one of alien creatures here to infect me. Ask about Project Solaris. Well, Stuckel, if I recall correctly, Project Solaris is the last location no in the game. <clears throat> now, uh, about Project Oh, Solaris. sorry. Solaris is the last location. Ah, Solaris, da. That I know something about. I worked on organic weapons program connected with Project Solaris. But I quit after I saw very strange things. Define no, I never played Conker's Bad for a day, but alien creatures it's a game like I definitely want to play. Giant space lobsters infecting humans and manipulating their bodies like giant marionettes. Like that. I feared I might be next, so I started working on weapon to fight them with. He's probably why Bro, some of those rare figures me. were so expensive, like or Ninjini or whatever. Or a Scarlet Ninjini. Oh my god. Sometimes you'd have to go to like a local gaming shop and they'd be selling it for like a hundred dollars. Oh my god, bro! I had I had this one friend who had like who had like money, and and man, he'd get all those he'd get all those ones, and then I'd find it years later in a little five dollar bag. Too funny. Ask about the weapon. This weapon you were working on. Yeah, I'm gonna play it one day, Phil. Work? I don't know. I never finished it. Because I have it in 64 now, so I'm trying to find the original game of it. When, when I find the original cartridge, fell from hell yeah. Sky. It was fragment of alien spacecraft. Computer data bank I used to create weapon. An alien artifact with data on the blisk. Will wonders never see. My my next N64 stream is going to be WWF No Mercy because I, I managed to find it. So that's the next one. That's the next one I'm gonna, I'm gonna play because I haven't played it before. So I'm gonna play it for the first time and see if it if it if it holds up to this day. Because here comes the pain hold, held up when I recently played that. So I, I want I wonder if No Mercy is as good as people say it is. Okay, I think I'm starting to get the picture. Where's this data thingy now? Should still be in the research facility in Gorodok Nauki. Um. Science Town. Catchy. I guess I better head over there and find it before the Krabbies do. Take care. Facility is well guarded. Good luck, Tavarish. Tavarish. Uh, what did you say name was? Uh, Tavarish sounds like a name that would Turiakin. be for like a WWE wrestler. Ilya Tavarish. Shuriakin. Nice to meet you. Yeah, like, um... I didn't grow up as I didn't grow up as a Nintendo kid. I grew up as a PlayStation kid. So there's a lot of games I haven't played, like that I want to play, like Donkey Kong Country, uh, Donkey Kong 64. Like I that's that's on my radar. Banjo Kazooie One and Two on my radar. Like if I find those games in the wild, I'm I'm getting them, as long as they're a reasonable price, of course. Because I, I I got an N64 just because of that. I got an N64, and I'm only buying exclusives for it. So right now I have I have, I have the I have the WCW games and I have um. WWF No Mercy, and I'm going to be getting WrestleMania 2000 eventually. You grew up on N64. So did my buddy. Which is why I see, I, I've seen a lot of, of the games played. I never played them myself, though. PS, yeah, the PS1 was my first love as well. And stuck with PlayStation ever since. Why is research facility needing electricity to operate? It has nuclear reactor for power. Yep. Right there I bought myself a GameCube recently, too. Yep. My cousin had a GameCube, so I, I was very familiar with the GameCube. I just, again, like I said, I just wasn't a GameCube kid myself. Use chemicals to kill humans. Yep, the day reckoning games are are my main are my main are on my list to get for the GameCube and the WrestleMania games. I have one WrestleMania one. I'm I'm still missing WrestleMania 
18 I'm missing, which is my favorite one of the WrestleMania games. And the day, uh, day of Reckonings is the games that me and my cousin would play all the time, bro. So I've been wanting to get them so I can replay. So I can, re so I can play them on stream and have them, like, you know, have my playthrough recorded pretty much. The comrade who came in from the cold. That's what the mission was called. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, I stuck with PS3. So many good PS3 games, but the 360 had a crazy amount of games. That are, that are that are now like pretty much playable on the new Xbox or PC, which is good. But there's plenty of PS3 games that are stuck in the PS3, like MGS4, which I'm hoping, which they they've been teasing they're gonna remake, which is good. So a lot of, so a lot of people can experience that game. Um, GTA GTA 4 stuck in the PS3 uh, because the PC version is broken. GTA 4 needs a remake. There was this Xbox game that I used to play at my, at my cousin's because he was an Xbox Nintendo kid, pretty much. It was called Fusion Fren Fusion Frenzy. That shit was such a fun, like, party, Mario Party type game. I wish they made... I wish they brought that back in modern consoles for, like, multiple game For, like, multiple consoles. A Hard Day's Fight. Oh, nice of you to drop by. That game sounds so familiar, Champions of North. Sounds so familiar. Isn't that like a Spartan game? It takes place in like the medieval times. Okay, Ox, what are we gonna do about these crabby blisk? They'll undoubtedly kill us if we don't kill them. Raphael, what's your man? Therefore, there's only one thing we can do destroy them! Starting with their crashed warship. Unfortunately, as discussed, its hull is impervious to Furon weaponry. It does, however, have a weakness. The main thruster protected by an armored hatch. Open that hatch, Crypto, and then bring on the Boom Boom! You are so cute when you do that. Look, did I get... I just got mentioned. Where is it? So how do I get this thruster hatch open? It's got to be locked down tight. It is. And my scans reveal the hatch controls have been disabled. It seems the Blisk have removed the Nexus crystals powering the circuit, but not destroyed them. Those crystals are still around somewhere. I'm reading a faint Nexus signature somewhere inside the Blisk base. Find the Nexus crystals to power the circuit and open the hatch. Then... Destroy that warship! I think little Crypto just woke up. All right, Poxy. I'm tan, rested, and ready. Let's bring this crab pot to a boil. Bam! Right! Head for the Blisk base and see if you can find those crystals. I'll keep scanning while you're inside. If I lock on to the crystals, I'll let you know. And be careful. These blisk are a lot stronger than anybody else I've fought. I got it. Don't worry. Pons Didn't they shut that game down or something? I swear just something about thing. it. Uh, which game? Everybody Conquer. Yes, they, they shut it down. I bet this game has more players now that Conquer left than players. Yo, Conquer had like 50 people. Here's the, here's the issue with Conquer. Yo, Starkiller, one second. I'll be back, Starkiller. Here's the issue with Conquer. Is that the way they marketed it, the trailer looked amazing. It looked like a really cool game. And then it just became another fucking mobile shooter or whatever like overwatch you, you know star killer go ahead continue the mission i'll be right back okay you, you can you can you can go ahead you can continue it i'll be right back
Okay. Yeah. Concord. Concord had to ha ha had to have been. Um, the first time I seen Sony have a, a massive commercial failure. I've never seen a game that that uh like that big of a failure in, in a long time. Yo, thank you so much, Arthur, for three months. Damn, bro, yeah, three months. Yeah, time's flying, eh? Time flew. But you know what? You know why Sony's you know why Sony's like canceled Concord, you know, eh? San Sony can canceled Concord so like so quickly. Good shit. Sony, Sony canceled Concord because they have marketing rights for GTA 6. You know what that means? That means GTA 6 is going to be marketed bundled with PlayStation Pros. They are not worried about closing down Concord, bro. They are not worried about the loss they got with Concord. <laughs> Next year, they are good. Like, can you imagine? Can you imagine the PS4 Pro sales they're gonna make? Oh, he got his. He got his shield back. Yeah, GTA yeah, 6 is going to break insane records, exactly. I'm just chucking explosives at it. Yeah, like the last time I seen a commercial failure of a game, it was that um, that zombie game that was a scam. Like, I'm not saying Conquer was a scam. Conquer at least tried to be a game, but that one zombie game, I can't remember what it was called, but they marketed it as a, as something that was completely different. And I'd say I'd say the, I'd say the closest the closest to another Sony failure was what they ended up doing with Hell Divers. Helldivers started so strong, right? And then they they did that thing where they fucked over Steam players or whatever. They forced them to have a PSN account, which then tanked the reviews. All right, start killed. Time for some platforming. We gotta scale the scale the spires. Oh, so close! I can barely make it. Is there is there a short? Oh, here we go. Gotta use the smaller platforms. Oh no, I fell off. Ah, oh, fuck, I fell off it. Got it.
Wait, it's not counting as me killing the mutants? Oh, they have to be in mutant form. Oh, that's why. No, Starkiller, you have to kill them as mutants, bro. You can't you can't swap them to humans. It wasn't it wasn't counting for me. This guy just glitched into this fucking building, bro. He glitched into the wall. One that, it's the one that's glitching here. Ho oh, hopefully that guy counts. Hopefully that counts. Okay, good. It did. It did. It's not a fatal game if I don't glitch it. Not letting me use it on the socket. Do I gotta damage it? Oh, oh I gotta damage it, okay. They have a cut edition. Don't waste your ammunition firing in the hull. The only vulnerable spot is inside that thruster. I I hope they go back to that their collector editions, bro. Oh, probably probably bigger. Rockstar always goes big with their collect editions. Fabulous work. Yeah, kind of lame. Okay. Fire a deconstructor package. Package explodes on impact, deals damage in a large area. Its ammo is is uh its ammo is harder to obtain. Hmm. Okay, let's upgrade my upgrade the ship some more. Repulsotron. There you go. Sonic Boom is maxed out now. About freaking time. Enough pussy putting around. Be one big boom boom. Use use QD on Blizz Towers. Oh, Quantum Destroyer got it. Uh Oh my god, I'm getting shit on. What the fuck? I can't Oh, 
Oh my god. I'll try to do the side objective. About freaking time. Enough pussy putting around. Do you want to make boom boom? Yeah, let me, let me get this let me get this complete first. Damn it, I'm still not. Oh shit. I need more ammo for the quantum destroyer. Still can't use it yet. How much ammo do I need? A hundred? Can't shoot it yet. One more. One more. There we go. Okay, let's get let's get rid of this bitch. Let's get rid of this bitch. This is why I level this bitch up. Come on, come on. Come on. Boom. That's exactly why I leveled up Sonic Boom right there. Yeah, I think I've seen the fog. For some reason, I thought you meant the mist. But yeah, I think I've seen the fog before. I don't remember it, so it wasn't that good then. That cinches it, Crypto! You've wiped out the Bliss base! I've half a mind to put you up for a medal, but only half. Yeah, that boss is pretty annoying, Star Killer, but the, the 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 most annoying boss is the final one. Although there was a way to cheese it in the PS2 game. I wonder if, if it still works. There's a way to cheese the final boss if you just go really high up in the uh in the air, you can like break the you can break the barrier and just attack him when he can't hit you. Yeah, the mist was really scary. Well, it's about time. I love endings like that. Hey, Pa, she seen the blonde babushka. She's supposed to meet me here. No, I haven't. As a matter of fact, you haven't even properly introduced us. Yeah, well, I'm trying to impress her. Oh, relax. I have more pressing matters than torpedoing your grand designs. Actually, I was hoping she could help us track down Millencalf. Perhaps she's with Agent Sony. I'm sure she is. Let jealousy take over. She crash out not crash out man i have had it with Ballad that crash out jerk off look at me i'm so handsome i'm so smart i read poetry i wrestle bears regardless you should probably find natalia she may even need your assistance yeah 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 i'm going good snoop around 
Somebody must have seen her. Who that she come, lad? This might be the this might be the last mission of this area. Poor pathetic prisoners being held in KGB base is not being four diamond hotel, I can be telling you that. What is going KGB agents were just talking about taking a track of female to so-called alien base. What is being with that? All right, Flisk, this is gonna get messy. Where did you know well, I'm there, all at a lobster? Dr. Orlov, just the cat I wanted to see. <laughs> it's, it's using your character now to talk to him. Oh, you're the one, you're the one controlling it. The fuck? You haven't seen a hot blonde cheek around here, have you? Name's Natalia. I did! Alien creature was taking pretty well. I'm in chapter four. Oh, what's, been, what's been hard about oh, it? Cookie. Everything what, is out to kill you in one or two hits. If they hurt a hair, so imagine you're playing a game, Raphael, where every I'm enemy every one to two one kills you. One to two hits. Well, and then the bosses, by short one time hit. Ago. If you hurry, Maybe you two, three, them. max. Uh, when finished, and they're aggressive. Could be rescuing me as well. Uh, I'll just wait. So imagine dying two hundred times in one boss. Or that's that, that's a little too much. Imagine dying like forty times in one boss, but dying like over four hundred times overall. Imagine getting so close to being the boss and then he he hits you randomly with a move you don't expect and you die immediately starting starting over. Yeah, shit. Yeah, I mean, you'll see. We're, we're about to beat this lo this level here. And that's what swap over. I'm currently stuck in a boss. So. Exactly. You have to it's trial and error. You got to learn their whole moves. You got to dodge perfectly every time. Or don't they teach sex ed in the young pioneers? I am not talking about STDs. He's been infested with alien spores. Indeed, he has Lapushka. I'm not afraid penicillin won't do the trick. Hello, Cryptosporidium. Millencop. Uh, sorry to rain on your communist party, but uh, in case you haven't noticed, your little base looks like Keith Moon redecorated. You've lost. Such bluster, such arrogance. You're beginning to sound like real American. Soon you'll be wearing cowboy hat and speaking in monosyllables. <laughs> hey, I'm already wearing one. Says you. The truth is, that was fitting. this base means nothing. At this very moment, we are preparing to initiate the final phase of Operation Solaris from our ultra secret main facility. On the moon. Yeah, so Solaris is it's on the moon. The That's the last location. Of this ideal. What a shame. Neither of you will be there to see it. Goodbye, Lapushka Moya. Das Vedania, Kratos Peridium. Keep your kakashnik on, dollface. You think I'm flying to the moon without you? Now we gotta destroy all the uh, tentacles there. Destroy the toxic farters? What? Just 
show the humans. go our toxicity well, level barely moved you. you saved the princess er natalia you should probably go over it you know make sure she's all right or something yeah maybe get a smoocherino yo have a blast with your son man Where, where did my costume go? Now the game removed my costume. Tavarish. Yo, the look she gave me. I think we're stuck. Killer, I think we're in, boys. It sucks. I think we're in. Melancholy got away, but I couldn't let you. You know. I know, Crypto, and thank you. But we still have to stop Melenkov, and he's halfway to the moon by now. Ugh, what are we going to do? Offer to use saucer. Uh, hello? Have saucer, will travel. I was wondering when you'd ask. Your saucer can take both of us all the way to the moon? Are you kidding? I've done so many mods on that baby. She'll give you everything but the happy end. <laughs> Kiss. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. Sure. Use my saucer. The good, the bad, and the furon. Our star killer. That should be Tuguska done, if I recall correctly. It should be finished. We should have the final, the final area left once we get there. So let's land on that bitch, and it should be, it should be good to go. You know, it's funny, Circular, this it's pretty cool. This game has a pretty fun uh, uh, co-op speedrun category where where two people try and speedrun through the story as, as quick as possible. It's crazy when you watch it. You got, like, one guy that does, like, all the main objectives, one guy will do, like, the side objectives, and yada yada, like, they have, like, a rhythm. It's badass. Okay, what can we level up? Anti Blisk. What's this? Energize Blisk Condenser. And increased damage. Improves its athletic and disintegrators. The energy efficiency. Reverse injury. Engineer Blisk Tech. Imp uh, blisk Tech. Improving its dead deadliness towards the Blisk. Yeah, we should use that. We should. We should. So we do more damage on the Blisk. Yeah, Sonic Boom's maxed out. 
upgrades the resilience of crypto shield against bliss technology. There we go. <laughs> With your Wi Fi 48 years, yeah. <laughs> Yo, new speed on record. We beat the game co op in 48 years. There it is. Sol Solaris. The last place. The last location, which we'll, we'll beat next time or tomorrow, whatever. Uh, beat this game tomorrow, just once we land. There it is. Fly me to the moon base. So this is this is the last location, Solaris. We're on the moon, and yes, there's anti-gravity, so if you jump, you go really high. Yeah. Okay. We will beat this game tomorrow. Thank you again, Star Killer. Thank you so much. We will beat this game tomorrow. So with those years, you'd be 98. Get the get the fuck. Get the fuck at my party right now. Get the fuck out of my party right now. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs>